What's going on everyone? Welcome back to 2GOZ Garage. From the title you guys can see, we got the new wheels for the 350Z. Before I show you guys what the wheels are, I want to give a massive shout out to Jonathan over at Luxury Choices for hooking me up with this deal. If it was not for him, this would not even be possible. So the wheels that we got, we got them in a heck of a deal. I don't want to put the price out there, but I'll just say they were I will probably never get a price like that again. So I like I had to pull the trigger and um dang, look at that super. I know you guys want to see that. But the wheels that I got for it are Vogue Racing two-piece RCF wheels. Now these things, they are in rough shape, but obviously I'm gonna get them redone with my boy Jonathan. So I'm just gonna show you guys the way they look now. We're gonna test fit them on the car and I need to decide on what color I wanna do these wheels. Of course, I'm gonna keep that polished lip. That's no question. So we're gonna get the polished lip redone and refinished. And that's gonna be looking extra spicy. So I need to decide on what color I'm gonna do the face and the inside lip. And it's a possibility that Jonathan can do a two-tone color. So he can do maybe the inside crease one color, the outside another color. You guys can tell me your opinion and what color you would do. But before we do anything, I think we should just throw them on a car and see how they look. I'm pretty sure they're gonna look really good. One thing that I am hoping for is that the front caliper is clear. So these, I'll tell you guys the specs. They're 19 by 10 and a half. Offset is plus 24. That's the rear tire. For the front, um, so according to, they are 19s obviously. Let's just assume that the front's gonna be like a 19 by nine or 19 by eight and a half, something like that. There's no sticker or label that shows the width of the wheel. So I don't know what the front specs are. I'm just hoping that the offset clears the front calipers because I don't wanna run a spacer. For the wheels that are on the car currently, I had to run a quarter inch spacer. You can see right in there because it was getting extremely close to my caliper and I just couldn't fit anything in there. Fingers crossed with these new wheels, the offset's good so that I don't have to run a spacer. Oh my gosh. Ooh, okay, so here is the old wheel. The Concept One, see the offset here, doesn't look like much. I think these are plus 30, plus 33, something like that. These newer ones, you can see that it has a lot more offset. So I am pretty confident that they're gonna clear without the spacer. So I'm gonna remove the spacer. You can see I have the extended studs. The problem is my lug nuts are not open, so I'm not gonna be able to use these, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna have to put the factory studs back on. Moment of truth. Oh yes, oh yeah bud. They clear the Brembo's just fine. Perfect. So you can see they clear the Brembo's no problem whatsoever. I think it's gonna sit perfectly because once I set it down, it's gonna go up in the fender a little bit. These things are probably gonna look perfect on this car. Ooh. Oh my God, look at that guys. It's gonna look sick. The good thing about the back ones is I'll be able to put them on and put the studs in because I have the factory studs. I don't have no spacer in the back. So I'm gonna put the back ones on now. These are what are gonna set this thing off. I hope so. I really hope the fitment's nice. There it is. I just seen the car with the wheels. It looks so sick, man. Next thing, it's gonna be freaking coilovers. I already know it. I got this thing aired up, but I can't get this thing to settle. Unless that is settled. I might have to roll it back a little bit, but I think that's how it's gonna be. Here we go. got me thinking I'm looking at the car right now and it looks good the way the wheels are so I'm thinking to do a color similar to these but add a little special stuff to it so these are the old concept one wheels these are the new ones you guys can let me know what you think 
It's pretty cool because it actually says what it is. It's a Volk Racing GTF. Super sick. Once they polish this thing out, I think that's going to go away. So I might not see that anymore. But yeah, this thing looks super, super cool. Fitment on it, it's not bad. You can see this is right over top of it. One of the goals with these new wheels is to have hot boy fitment. Obviously, I want to have this thing flush to the fender. Probably gonna get a little wider tire on this thing. It actually it might be the same exact size. Now that you guys see the wheels on the car, what color would you do them? Would you do them a two-tone or all solid color? I'm gonna have the polished lips, like I said. What color would you do the face and what color would you do the inside lip? I can probably have Jonathan do like this inside groove blue or black or silver and the face blue or black or silver, like, I don't know. This thing looks so good, man. Like I said, I would greatly appreciate it if you guys leave me some feedback down below and let me know what you would do if this was your car. Would you use these wheels, get another wheel, or would you, like what color would you do these? Like I don't know, man. I just there's just so many ideas in my head, and I don't know which one to do because like I can get pretty crazy and do some wild stuff with it, but I don't want to get too wild where it looks kind of tacky. I want it to look just right. These wheels look so sick, man. You see the new ones, and these are the old ones. You guys prefer these or the Volks? I don't know, man. I might have to pick these. I really like these new ones. They look pretty sick. If you guys enjoyed watching me test fit my new wheels, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you're excited to see the next steps to this process and build. This is gonna look wild. It's gonna be a completely different car once I'm done. Just hit that, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel, man. You, you, you won't regret it. I got some cool stuff coming pretty soon. Peace out and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.